we have come to value the specialization to such a degree that it has divided us in many, many different ways. We don't think of lawyers anymore as lawyers, but they are corporate lawyers, or they are antitrust lawyers, or they are estate lawyers, or they do wills and trusts. Doctors and surgeons we know very well. There are specialties have taken over. And yet the demand now is for the doctor who is not the specialist, but for the family practice doctor. This has also translated itself into the fascination, almost a reverence that we have for the specialists. We are anti-war people, or we are pro-life people, or we are pro-choice people, or we are people concerned only about poverty, we are people focused only on health care, we are green people, we are child advocates, we are tea party people, and we are environmentalists. And the point that I'd like to make in my very short five minutes is simply to say that we should wrestle together with what it means to the unity of humankind and to the fact that everything relates to everything and everyone relates to everyone. And this is what it is going to bring our world to a different place. We have to find a way beyond our fascination with specialization to have proper respect for it, but not to let it own us. The fact of the matter is that the greatest call for people of faith is the call to unity. We care not only about the issue we care about, not only about the people who are like us, who we understand, but we care about the whole of humanity and the whole of the earth and everything that surrounds us. The reason climate is so important is because it is in fact an issue that moves beyond specialization and calls us to a deeper understanding of the unity of all of humankind. And I believe that's why we're here is because we're able to care beyond ourselves, beyond our specialty, beyond our nation, beyond our race, beyond our gender, and even beyond the times in which we live. Because we are called, I believe, to live into the future that God wills for God's people. And that may be the most important thing that we can understand. And we've lost the capacity to see profoundly beyond what affects us personally and our family or even our nation. We're really called to a huge task, and that is to care about the whole of humanity and the whole of this planet that feeds us. And that, I think, is what climate is ultimately.